Grab your coats, scarves, and hats because the coldest air of the season is moving in across the country. This comes after a snowstorm created some messy conditions on the road for travelers over the holiday weekend. ABC meteorologist Samara Theodore is tracking all of that for us. Hi, Samara. Good morning, Diane. That's correct. Take a look. Speaking of that, this is in Wichita, Kansas. There they saw 7.8 inches of snow. This makes this the snowiest November they've seen since 1951. So a lot of snow in the heartland. Then we saw the snow moving into the Great Lakes as that system zoomed out. The snow you're looking at on your screen from uh, Muskegon, Michigan, is actually lake effect snow. And that's the next big issue that we have today and tomorrow because on the back end of this system, we get this wind moving in this cold air over the warmer water. And that is the perfect recipe to turn on that lake effect snow machine. So if you look at the totals that we're anticipating through Wednesday, Wednesday. Cleveland up to Erie, uh, generally anywhere from three to six inches, but then you get uh, a little farther north where that fetches greater. Jamestown, six to 12 inches of snow is certainly possible. And then look up near Watertown, New York, upstate New York. This is a spot that definitely gets hit hard uh, with that angle coming in over the warmer water, that cold air. So there they could see anywhere from one to two feet of snow through Wednesday. And so that may pose as an issue for those traveling home around the Great Lakes region. And as you said, this is some of the coldest air of the season that we're dealing with. Wind chills this morning were in the single digits and teens by 11 a.m. Some spots around 23 degrees feeling like that in Kansas City. Look up in Minneapolis, zero degrees. I am not ready, Diane. And me neither, but I think, I guess it's nearing December. It's time. Indeed. ABC <laughs> meteorologist Samara Theodore. Thanks, Samara. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.